We launched this as a YouTube competition to reach a younger audience with new and novel ideas that we could develop into full X prizes. Our mission at the X Prize Foundation is to launch prizes that have radical breakthrough for the benefit of humanity. And we're hoping through this competition to find new concepts that we can launch as Energy X Prizes. We have two primary purposes for being here. Uh, the first is to announce the winner of our What's Your Crazy Green Idea YouTube video contest. Uh, the second uh, uh, is the chance to have a real fun, in-depth, vibrant conversation about the viability of the winner's idea and where the X Prize uh, should be going in the energy environment space. And the envelope says the winner is. And, and the winner is the Capacitor Challenge. <laughs> One of my dreams was, you know, one day start a company and, um, you know, do something like what Dr. Diamandis has done. Yeah, we, were, we were very excited to hear that we were the winners. I think that this type of competition being put on YouTube was uh, an excellent way to find new ideas that potentially haven't reached the corporate energy market yet. Um, by casting out just this wide net out into the YouTube community, XPRIZE Foundation, Sort of, uh, sort of fostered this new debate over energy in ways that prob people probably thought they didn't have any sort of a say in. Participating in the, the roundtable discussion was very interesting. Uh, I was very, very happy to meet all of those different people and uh, very respectful towards them and their work in the, the field of energy. It was very interesting. Uh, what's very heartening is the youth and the energy of all of the uh, entries there. It was Beautiful. Uh, so that, that sort of says, look, this is what's going to carry us. I think a, a battery technology that allows the cell phone to go um, for you know, a month without recharging or, or the, the laptop can go for weeks without recharging, I mean, those things have a personal value to people I think can transform a lot faster than traditional technology. So I'm really hopeful something like this can actually happen fast and transform quickly. So if you can run some of those numbers that you did on that capacitor and you start to lead with the numbers as well as the altruism, actually I think you get a much, much better opportunity to make these things happen. And then you get the other benefit of, and guess what, it changes the world. We at Prize Capital really believe that as well, that you have a prize that attracts people to a goal, but supporting the entrepreneur that's focusing on the, that out of the box idea and um, really, you know, focusing more on the new ideas that are coming out there, the new entrepreneurs, the people that are really creative instead of just following the herd, instead of just putting money into technologies that have already been established. We're living in the period of the greatest extinction uh, since Noah. And I think that that is only going to be solved by having energy and energy efficiency ideas. And those ideas are going to have, it's my personal belief that those ideas are going to have to come from places other than where uh, the ideas that got us into some of these predicaments have come to. I want to uh, take a moment to in particular thank uh, Vulcan Ventures, uh, Jill Watts uh, and, uh, and David Moore. Uh, and the Gordon and Betty Moore Foundation for their generosity in helping us to think through uh, our energy environment X prizes. So thank you everybody and now I think we're off to a tour of uh, BT's uh, solar facilities. <laughs>